our beautiful first lady, Mrs. Rebecca Kufuado. Your Excellency, the Vice President, the man of the moment, Mahmoudou Baumia. And our second lady, party elders, party members, who later became president. Somehow, Kufuado picked the same young man to be his running mate. Till then, Baumia was not even in the main stream of party. He was a party man, all right, but behind the scenes. So he picked him, and uh, of course there were, there were some surprises. People expressed misgivings. I thought of it, and then at a party meeting in the Aliza Hotel, I remembered my first meeting of, with this young man in London, and what I told him. Then it dawned on me again to more or less prophesy. I appealed to the party just to accept this man to carry on, man of destiny. Today we've all gathered here to launch him as our presidential candidates for 2024 election for president of Ghana. As I said, I've come to bear witness that this man definitely is on a mission, a mission determined by destiny. And please, let's all accept him to, to continue. We happen to be living in times where the whole world, the whole world is in a flux. Leadership is very, very scarce. Quality leadership. If anybody aspires to be a leader without command of the new technologies, like digitalization, <laughs> new technologies to pick the requisite manpower, and here, allow me, I'm a party man, soundly, but I tell you, we should be talking about the nation and not so much about the party. But get people of competence to work with him to find our way out of the confusion our society and economy have been plunged into. I wouldn't blame any side. To look at the track records of all the parties, I tell you, you can't find one that can say that in their time they were excellent or superb. No. We are in a new situation and I believe the saying that come with the, the man is now. It has come for this man and I like the theme that I posted against the wall. Look at behind the lectern there. Bold solutions for the future. Without the preparations I've talked about, understanding the new technologies and knowing and really committed to your nation to secure a decent and dignified niche in the global context for your nation, that is geopolitics. Without them, I tell you, we will continue to wallow. So, I'm witnessing that, I, it seems, look at the field of the arena of presidency now, it seems this man destined for this time in Ghana. I'm appealing to the whole nation to give him the chance to come. And I have a feeling I have a very strong feeling he is truly the man of the moment and Ghana must accept him. So this is it. Thank you very much. A big round of applause for His Excellency, the former president, John Ajekum Kufuo. And that's a handshake of blessing.